Unveiling the Memories, Understanding, Reliving the Past. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning journey. Today, we're diving into a fascinating phrase that often pops up in conversations, stories, and reflections. Reliving the past. This expression holds a wealth of emotions and memories, and understanding it can enrich your comprehension and use of the English language. Let's embark on this exploration together and uncover the depths of what it means to relive the past. Reliving the past combines two key words, reliving and the past. To relive something means to experience it again, to go through the emotions, thoughts, or events as if they are happening at this moment. The past refers to events that have already occurred, times gone by that are no longer present. When we put these two together, reliving the past, describes the process of mentally or emotionally going back to previous times in one's life, experiencing those moments and feelings once more. People relive the past for various reasons. Some might find comfort in nostalgia, recalling happy, joyful moments that bring a smile to their faces. Others may find themselves reliving past mistakes or painful experiences, perhaps to understand them better or to find closure. Reliving the past can serve as a powerful tool for self-reflection, allowing individuals to learn from their experiences and grow as persons. Reliving the past has a profound impact on our emotional well-being. On one hand, it can be therapeutic, helping individuals deal with unresolved issues or reconnect with happy memories that boost their mood. On the other hand, it can also lead to rumination, where one becomes stuck in a cycle of overthinking about past events, which can hinder personal growth and current happiness. It's important to find a balance, allowing oneself to learn from the past without being overwhelmed by it. When discussing, reliving the past, it's essential to be mindful of the context and emotions involved. You might hear phrases like, I often find myself reliving that day, indicating a specific moment the speaker frequently revisits mentally. Or, she relives her childhood through these old photographs, showing how tangible items can trigger memories and emotions tied to the past. Understanding these nuances can enrich your conversations and deepen your empathy towards others' experiences. Thank you for joining me on this exploration of reliving the past. It's a phrase rich with emotion, memory, and meaning, offering a window into the human experience. By understanding and using this expression, you can enhance your English communication, connect with others on a deeper level, and navigate the complexities of human emotions with greater sensitivity. Remember, the past holds lessons and memories, but it's in the present that we have the power to shape our future. Keep learning, keep growing, and I'll see you in our next video.